Welcome everyone to German Tour Reviews. Today we have the Vera 032060 six piece stainless craft form set with model number 3334 6. I was really impressed by the quality of the stainless steel L key set from Vera and wanted to pick up a set of these drivers. As noted on the box, the main features of these drivers are the stainless alloy used, the laser etched tip, and the familiar craft form ergonomic handle. You will notice that these drivers use a blue white color on the driver handle as opposed to the dark green that you normally see in Vera craft form drivers. This makes these easy easily distinguishable from the other Vera drivers that you may have in your toolbox. So let's crack the box open. Inside we have a black plastic holder and an unmarked white cardboard box containing the drivers. Inside the box the drivers are scattered in a rather loose manner. It looks like an attempt was made to reduce the movement of the tools with one of these air packs. However the package was clearly ruptured from one of the drivers. That is something they should probably take a look into if others have the same issue. The drivers included with this set are from the 3350 Phillips series we have a Phillips number 1 by 80 millimeters and a Phillips number 2 by 100 millimeters. From the 3335 slotted series we have a slotted 0 0.5 by 3.0 by 80 millimeters, a 0 0.8 by 4.0 by 100 millimeters, and a 1.0 by 5.5 by 125 millimeters. From the 3334 slotted series, we have a 1.2 by 6.5 by 150 millimeters. All of these drivers contain the Vera laser tip except for the smallest slotted driver. I must say that I'm very impressed with the quality and workmanship of these drivers. The finish on these is extremely well done. Looking at the driver tips under magnification, we can see that the laser tip finish that is applied to most of the drivers in the set. Since this is something that I haven't seen on other drivers, I figured Vera must have a utility patent on the etched screwdriver tips. And sure enough, I was able to find US patent 6883405 that was issued on April 26, 2005, detailing the features of the laser etched tips. The patent describes a process for producing the tips using a laser to actually melt the surface of the metal to produce parallel channels. The resulting surface on these channels is considerably harder than the adjacent material because the laser is essentially annealing the material as it cools. There is even data presented in the patent that claims that the channels have at least a 5 HRC higher hardness than the accompanying driver surface. The purpose of these grooves is to allow the edges of the channels to dig into the screw head, which counteracts the cam out effect. I hope to someday really quantify the advantage of the laser tips but that is out of the scope of this review. There is definitely a lot of engineering and precision manufacturing that goes into these laser tips, which is why they are more expensive than the non-laser etch wearer drivers. I noticed that some of the drivers had magnetized tips while others didn't. Since this is a magnetic stainless steel alloy, all the tips could be easily magnetized with the proper magnetizing tool if required. The handles on these drivers were also exceptional. The ends of the drivers are etched with the driver type and size along with the word stainless. What is interesting here is that it looks like the markings were either part of the mold or engraved directly into the plastic. The impressions of the markings were then painted silver to make them easier to read. You can tell Vera really pulled out all the stops on these drivers. The plastic holder that comes with the drivers is one of Vera's generic holders that comes with many of their other products. For this particular application, it is designed to be hung on a wall or toolboard, and then the drivers are slipped into the holes from the top. I couldn't find any mold marks to identify the type of plastic, but it appears to be ABS. These holders can also be used with the craft form micro drivers that can be snapped into place and then can be used on a desktop or workbench. This is probably what I'm going to use this particular holder for. I was talking with someone who works in a machine shop and buys Vera craft form sets all the time and he said that he's always just thrown away the holders. I'm not sure if this is the experience of others but I wouldn't mind seeing a version of this set without the rack. You can of course buy each of the drivers individually as needed. I've been testing the drivers for the past couple of weeks and I would have to say that these are probably my new favorite drivers. I originally only purchased these to use for stainless fasteners but it is tempting to now use them for all jobs. This particular Desert Tan Hoffman Junction box I took home because it was being scrapped and has been sitting in storage for over 10 years. The slotted screws holding down the panel were very tight but the Vera drivers had no issues loosening them without any cam outs. If you're someone that works with Phoenix terminal blocks, I found that the smallest driver included with the set is the perfect size for the most common terminal block screws. I really tried to find something to complain about with these drivers, but I couldn't. One suggestion I would have to Vera is to offer a slightly longer Phillips number two driver in this style. I would like to see them offer a 200 millimeter or 300 millimeter shaft length like the regular craft form drivers. I hope someday in the future to actually do a long-term corrosion test with these particular drivers and maybe compare some of the other stainless drivers that some of the other companies will offer. Well, that wraps up this review of the Vera 334-6 stainless driver set. Affiliate links to both KC Tool and Amazon for this set are in the description below. Also, check out the link in the description to the full review. If you like this video, subscribe for more reviews of German brand tools.